this job is just so amazing. Good morning, everyone. It has been a crazy few days around here. I believe it was the day before yesterday it actually snowed here in Texas. I know that in Austin and up towards Fort Worth, it definitely got a lot more snow, but it was still just like incredible to see snow here in Texas. I still can't believe it. Luna is always stealing our socks. Does your dog like to steal your clothes? Luna loves to. Luna's got her party ball with her now. We call it her party ball because it lights up. For today's vlog, I just wanna take you all through my day like I normally do, but also since being furloughed, I've had a lot of time to reflect on why I love being a flight attendant and how you can become one. That's one of the most frequently asked questions that I get. So I thought I would just take a minute here to talk a little bit about that and then we can get going with the rest of my day. So if you are someone who is thinking of becoming a flight attendant, I think the first thing you really need to ask yourself is why? Why do I want to become a flight attendant? What is it in my life that I think I'm lacking or that I really want and desire? And what is it about being a flight attendant that can fulfill those needs? For me, I obviously really wanted to travel and that is obviously a huge part of the job, but I also wanted a career where I knew I would be helping others and I knew I would be interacting with more people. And right after I graduated college, I did an internship as a copywriter. It was only 20, 20 25 hours a week, so it was part-time. And even just doing that, I knew that a standard nine to five desk job was not for me. Obviously, due to the pandemic, there's a lot of airlines that are not hiring right now, but there actually are some that are. And I also think that right now, it's a really good time to do your research on different airlines and to make sure that this is a career that you would really want to pursue. So I'm going to make sure that I put a link in my description box below to this website that I found that lists all of the different airlines and highlights the ones that are hiring and will take you directly to their websites and and if this is something that you guys are interested in is learning more about the hiring process and sort of like the nitty gritty about how to become a flight attendant, please let me know in the comments below, leave me some questions, and then maybe I can film a full video about all of those details. So I'm going to throw on some workout clothes and then head to the gym. I just got to the gym and just looking at the parking lot, it's pretty crowded today. So I may or may not film when I'm in there. Usually if it's pretty packed, I don't always film because I I just don't want to make anyone feel uncomfortable and it's also kind of awkward for me when people stare while I'm filming so um, I don't know we'll see but no matter what I'm gonna go in and get a good workout all right you guys so I found a like totally secluded area in the gym however the lights are broken so just bear with me I know the lighting in here is awful I just got home from the gym and I'm about to make a new video live here on my channel. This is the video right here that I am making live. So if you haven't seen it yet, make sure that you go check it out. Private and public. Eric is making us some lunch and I believe we're actually having breakfast sandwiches. Is that what we're having? It's the plan. Mm -hmm. So when we lived in Colorado, one of our favorite places to eat at was called Brugger's. It's a great like breakfast and bagel shop and I think they have some of them on the East Coast. Anyways, that's what inspired today's meal because we really like burgers. We have our eggs over here, bagels, and Eric did the sausage. We're gonna cook everything up.
Here's the finished breakfast sandwich. It's just a plain bagel. And then we have the sausage and the egg and cheese. It looks so good. Eric's the best. All right, first bite of the Sammy. Mmm, it's warm. It's so good. Only thing that would make this sandwich better is if I had my bell peppers because I always get the sriracha egg sandwich from Brugger's minus the sriracha sauce because I don't like anything hot. And it comes with the bagel, the sausage patty, egg, cheese, and roasted bell peppers and it is so good. Just got outside taking Luna out for her midday frisbee time and just looking through and reading the comments from my last video. I just can't thank you all enough for being so supportive and being the best subscribers ever. I honestly cannot wait to go back to flying and to making flight attendant vlogs and travel vlogs. I just think it's going to be so fun. And like I mentioned earlier, this job is just so amazing and there's so many different aspects of it that I miss and I can't wait to really bring that back to my channel. If becoming a flight attendant is something that you wanna do, I say go for it. Just really give it your all. Apply to as many airlines as you can. I know that, you know, it's 2021 and a lot of different airlines aren't hiring, but like I mentioned earlier in this video, there still are a lot that are. So go for those and just see what happens. It's honestly an amazing career and and even being furloughed right now, I am just like so grateful and so blessed that I have it. And I'm just, I don't know, I'm feeling really good today. And I'm just so excited to go back. I love when she jumps to catch her frisbee. She's so athletic. Right now, I am at the park, just walking Luna. This is one of our favorite places to go and it is so pretty, especially over the summer. You can just have all the trees and the grass and if I have some old videos from the summer, I'll include those now. It's still beautiful, even with all the trees that are dead. But I mean, gosh, I am just thinking about it and I'm like, I am already ready for spring and summer. I am so ready for warm weather. I am not a cold weather girl. It's still pretty though, huh, Luna? Sometimes we just have to find the beauty around us. I'm making something different for dinner tonight that I've never cooked before. I am making a Middle Eastern chickpea and pistachio bowl. So we have the rice cooking in here and I just seasoned the tomatoes and chickpeas. I have all the other stuff over here. So I think it's gonna be a great meal. Dinner is done and I'm not gonna lie. These look really good. All right, let's do a taste test. Mmm, this is so good. I have loved trying to cook new foods. It is so fun. Good morning, everyone. It's the next day and I'm about to go pick up Luna from the groomers. She was not very happy with me when I dropped her off this morning, but she really like really needed a bath and really needed her nails trimmed. So we're gonna go pick up the pretty girl. There not she is. Sure I've ever heard this right, but. <laughs> Good girl. Oh, you look so pretty. Hi, beautiful girl. Look at that cute bandana. You look all nice and fancy now. You ready to go home? Luna's eating her breakfast now, but they did a good job. All of her floof right here is gone though. The toes look good. The booty look good. Extra floofy still. And her fur is so soft. Yeah, Luna, you look good after a haircut. I think she wants one of these. All right, Lena, brush your teeth. She always takes it and runs to the carpet and eats it over here. 